Remember, it's not all about crunch, crunch, crunch. What's up, team? Welcome back. We're doing another workout here at the TB Fit channel. Come join me at the space. Let's get it in. In three, two, one. All right, everybody. We have core today. So, you know how I like doing my core exercises. I like to make it a little bit difficult, a little bit challenging. Um, you know, working on stability points with the core, right? So I'm holding onto this band here. As you can see, I'm kind of shaking with my hands because I'm working on keeping that stiffness in my lat, right? I'm trying to keep that stiffness and that lock in my lat. So I'm maintaining my, so I'm making sure that I'm maintaining my shoulder position um, embracing my upper body as I'm bracing my lower body, my lower abs, obviously, right? My tailbone is pressed into the mat. You guys already know the lower abs are nice and engaged during that whole exercise. As you bring the legs, uh, as you bring the legs out for that exercise. Okay. So make sure your, your core stays braced when you're doing those dead bugs and your lats stay locked when you're doing, um, when you're doing the dead bugs as well. But for this next one, we are going to be in a push-up position almost on the med ball and work our climbers, work our mountain climbers in this, again, unstable position, challenging your body in these weird, in these weird positions, okay? So push the ball into the ground. Uh, make sure your shoulder is kind of getting that uh, protraction, what it's called. So you really want to push and drive into that ball uh, to make sure you're, you're, you're kind of locking that position and you're not falling over and you're not making the ball roll away. As you drive the knees through, boom, boom. Get the, keep the legs long, get your knee all the way to your chest. Next exercise we got is the wood choppers with our red band, okay? So you can also use a cable machine for this one if you like, but I had bands today, so I use the bands. So make sure you're pulling from top to bottom, okay? Notice my foot position. Make sure you have your, your feet and your legs oriented in the fashion that I do for this exercise. Make sure your core is braced and you're stable while you are pulling most important part because we're working core so it's all about balance and control for it okay stay focused same thing other side stay in that half kneeling position keep the, the heel close to that back knee because that's again a position of of challenge and that's what I want all right you guys keep your good posture notice how my body is upright my shoulders are staying back on that exercise awesome toes to bar is next grab one tight to your bar Minimize your swinging as best you can when you do this. I know it's hard not to swing, but that is part of the exercise. That's part of the core work. It's on the way down, it's controlling and minimizing that swing. For me, that's actually the hardest part. Okay, so control and then hip lift up, touch the bar if you can. And if you can, get a little bit over the bar. Get your, get your feet a little bit over the bar. Um, yeah, to make it harder. Drive it up. Yes, yes, yes. Woo! All right, you guys, so I just finished a workout at the gym. We did the core circuit. It was so dope. Got some functional work in, got some rotational work in, right? Remember, it's not all about crunch, crunch, crunch. It's about complete core strength, right? Complete core functionality, which means you need to rotate, you need to bend laterally, you need to, you know, you could do some, you, you could do some crunch type exercises, but just, it shouldn't be all flexion based. Okay, you should mix it up. All right, so hopefully you guys, whew, 
Just, yeah, breathe hard. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that workout. Um, definitely hit up the last workout. It was so awesome. Hit up that last kettlebell workout that we did uh, in this area over here, okay? So check out that video if you haven't already. And then, uh, yeah, we'll see you next week. And make sure you keep working hard for me, okay? Peace.